Okay, so we'll be proving this result that my GL2R modulo SL2R is isomorphic to R star. Well, here, what are the notation that we are using? GL2R is nothing but collection of all 2 cross 2 matrices over real numbers such that the determinant is non-zero. That means we have collected all invertible matrices which forms a group under multiplication. SL2R is nothing but collection of all those matrices which has determinant as 1 which again is a group under multiplication. And on the right side of the isomorphism, we have R star. That means it is nothing but a collection of all non-zero real numbers, which is also a group under multiplication. Whenever we work on the group, the operation on which we are working is always the most important. Also, the next thing students should remember is, whenever you see a quotient, quotient group somewhere, the first thing that we can use in most of the cases is nothing but first isomorphism theorem. So what is the first isomorphism theorem for the group? If I have f from g to h an onto group homomorphism, then my g by kernel f is isomorphic to h, where kernel of h, kernel of f is nothing but collection of all those elements from the domain g which get mapped to 0 in the codomain. Okay, so by using this concept, we'll be using the required result. Okay. Let's see the result. I want to prove GL2R modulo SL2R is isomorphic to R star. So I define first of all a map. I define a map F from my GL2R which is a group under matrix multiplication to R star under multiplication that is non-zero real number under multiplication of real number by well, here I have matrix on the codomain or inside the range I have numbers. So how can we have the matrix to how can we map a matrix to a number? The most easy way to do that is by determinant operation and also we know the domain is somehow connected to the determinant. So that is something but the hint. So we defined my f of a will get mapped. Any matrix will get mapped to the determinant of that matrix for all a inside my domain that is gl2r. If I prove this map is an onto homomorphism, I can use first isomorphism theorem. So the first part is we'll be proving it is an homomorphism. So, what is an homomorphism meaning? A map is an homomorphism if it preserves operation. That means my f of a times b, since the operation is multiplication a times b, in the codomain also it is multiplication, so it is f of a times f of b. If I can prove this, it becomes a homomorphism. Let me just consider my f of a, b f of ab is what f of ab is nothing but determinant of ab because uh, operation is nothing but matrix getting mapped to the determinant so what is the determinant of a into b that is nothing but determinant of a times determinant of b right by the properties of the determinant we know that this is same as determinant of a times determinant of b determinant of a is same as f of a determinant of b is same as f of b hence what we found ultimately is f of ab is same as f of a into f of b. Therefore, if homomorphism, right? It is a group homomorphism. After the homomorphism, we will be proving whether it is an onto or not. What is the meaning of the word onto? Every point in the codomain should have a pre image. So, for any a inside my codomain. What is this codomain? That is nothing but set of all non-zero numbers. There should exist a 2 cross 2 matrix inside my GL2R such that my F of that matrix should be A. Okay, so for any A, a non-zero real number, I should find out that matrix. What could be that matrix? It should be inside GL2R. GL2R, what does it mean? It should be invertible, nothing else. 
So suppose if I create a matrix 1, A, 0, 0. So the determinant of this matrix is nothing but 1 into A that is A. Since A is non-zero, it is 